Back on the engine here now again, making up the driver, well sent to the back of the tender. Just have a rough marked out there now. This one's going to look like when it's finished, something similar to that. Driver now ready for welding. Feed out there. Bush there is just to keep it in place. Stop it from shifting. And the engine now again here we have a mock-up of the tender the way it's going to look that'll be his two tubs this one here and the right will be for coal and the one over then will be for water hopefully it'll hold about 40 kgs of coal and about 32 gallons of water so the plan here then is be standing down in the bottom of the tender. Everything is accessible then at that. Got the wheels back from blasting and painting. Johnny done a nice job on him, in fairness. Also we put in a I'll put a canopy on it. The fact that just standing inside now, you have plenty of headroom. The boxes are tacked in position there now. Need a coal bunker on this side. The floor to go in there, yeah. Cut out is for the driver. A water tank, it's best sort of 15 or 16 gallons inside now. So there'll be a seat now on top of that. And there'll be a cut out there on the side of the tender where that block is there, then it's a step getting in and out. Rest of the water tank could be inside of it. 
Should walk over to him. Stopped at a beating gland, I don't know. It's heated to the contours of the tank. It'll be riveted in place then after. Let's take the rough edge off it. A piece will be going along the back there then. You probably have to seat up then like that. It's sitting up to an eight at most somehow. That's the plan on it. Beating his hand down out. Worked out handy enough. Plates are welded in place. Let's rivet them on out. The beading where them bolts are sticking in. That's where the seat will be sitting roughly. The top must be still welded in. So passenger there. Let's put in the plates for the tank down next. So right, we have another bit of progress on the tender. That'll be your coal in there. It's a second water tank. Let me cover it and bolt it onto the front of that. So you'll be standing now on the bottom of the tank. Cut out there to get in and out. There'll also be a canopy on it. So I need to mock up there a while. So this is another water tank here. That lid will be bolted on after. So that's your cut out now for in and out. Just to finish off the beading, a few rivets. This is just a step for the passenger. So when there's a passenger on board then. You can pull out that step. Just get your leg up in it. Plenty of room in there now for some fella to sit up. Let's cut out that angle arm, make a bit of room. Finish off the riveting around the beading there. Less the tender finished, ready for shop blasting painting. still must go in. That's it.